All right, what I'm doing here, I've got the Jungle Menace, the McGilla Crawl color on a half ounce wrecking ball. Just a second, I'll give you a closer up shot. But I'm dragging it on the bottom like this, catching fish like this. All right, here's the half ounce wrecking ball. As you see, it's a swivel head, what we call a wrecking ball. The McGilla Crawl color, Jungle Menace. It's like one of the best comparison to a crawfish color there is. And what I'll do is, you can see where the barb is, right here. I'll put it just past the barb like so. Point it outside. That way it don't interfere with the head swivel. And of course, hold up, you can see where the hook entry needs to be which is right there so you just put it in the middle of the body and that so you won't try and get it this is my OCD but talking but get it as straight as possible and then all I'm doing I know there's some hard bottom out here and stuff we put out there to try to attract the fish but just for fun throw out there and you just drag it real slow or it's a slow steady wind Like so, and it bounce around and look like this creature bait here crawling across the bottom, imitating a crawler just going across the bottom here. Are you serious? Pound. Pound. Oh my gosh. I told him it was his turn. He said, you ready? I said, yeah. I'll be dang if he didn't have a fish on. Are you kidding me? Ah. Wrecking ball and jungle menace. Strikes again. What made you choose the crawl color? Uh, question I was asked is why I chose to go with the crawl color. One day flipping, caught a big bass, like about that size there, and she was on the deck and she spit up a crawler she had just got done eating. It just died. And, and I just so happened to have this color on the deck as well, and the crawler landed right by it, and it was like a perfect match. So I decided to go with that crawler. To go with that. Holy moly. No way. Jungle menace in the wrecking ball strikes again, folks. I got the shell hang on. Wow. How about that? How much? Uh, I said about four pounds. I say five. Oh, okay. So he's got a scale. Let's he's see. got a scale. I'm guessing five. Jake, you got a scale coming? My lord. That's what the menace does. And the neighbors are loving it. <laughs> All right, got it. Ready? Five, nine. Five, nine. Oh, oh my six. lord. Five, nine. <laughs> Love it. Oh, wait. <laughs> I have to say that the wrecking ball is probably one of the most versatile styles of fishing right now because 
I use it both in winter and summertime because fish go deep, they go on structure, they go on shell beds. And this bait here, this technique works for both. Uh, so I highly recommend people going and getting it.